Alrighty, everyone. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Battle Brothers. As we follow along with the Dead Runners here on the Legends mod, running our Iron Man campaign, the second one, in fact. And as we left off in the last episode, we have some zombies to fight. Um, well, I don't know if it's zombies per se, but it's undead. So, uh, so let's start. Let's go ahead and engage this group here. And see what we got. Maybe. Yep. <laughs> Woo! Double sneeze. Uh, and the game froze. Potentially? It froze, and I'll be right back. All right, and we are back. Hopefully, we will be able to actually see our enemies, and in this case, yes, we do. Perfect. And there's 24 of them. Um, okay, never mind. Um, do I mean, do we fight this? Do we fight this? Here, hold on. Uh, we could potentially, but oh, man, I just, I don't think so. I don't think we have enough armor and pure damage to deal 24 or to, to deal with 24 weeder gangers. Now, this would be a great opportunity to get some equipment here, but nonetheless, I think realistically that's just Maybe what we do is So it actually actually it looks like most of these guys there's very little armor available to them. So maybe we do fight these guys. You know? No, I, I think 8 versus 24. We need we need 10. We need 10 guys. Like, if that were going to be the case, that's one thing. This is not... This is not a thing. We're outnumbered 3 to 1, and our troops, while they are decent, are not of a sufficient level, even to deal with this, like, realistically. Just the overall damage. Uh, Let's just retreat. Yeah. No, I, I think the overall damage just from however many hits these guys are going to get is just too much. I think it's just too much. I hate to say it. But, uh, and now we need to run away from the goblins too. Which is just terrible. But, uh, in any case. In any case. Uh, let's try and run away from these goblin raiders. Some ambushers and many skirmishers. Now, if we can get in the mountains and potentially get down here. Oh, no, no, no. There we go. There we go. There we go. Hide. Hide from the goblin raiders. Perfect. Excellent. Let's go back. All right. Crypt of Mourning. Uh, so yeah, we're out of food. It's kind of a problem. 50% more recruits are available. Oh, selling items for 10% less. Huh, nice. Um, that's quite nice, actually. Uh, let's go ahead and try and get the camp kitchen. See if we can get any money. No, we did not. That's fine. We still need some food. Uh, and it looks like the food is not too terribly expensive here, which is good. We have a little bit of that. There are some additional recruits here. Uh, and and let's see. Let's see. So we do have two more slots available. I, I do know that we need to uh, improve our standing here. But I don't see anyone who's really going to be worthwhile for our cause. Um, yeah, we, we got to... I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We got to cancel that one. But let's take a look at this one. 840 crowns. Uh... No, I, I don't think we, again, have enough money for that either, which really sucks. Oh, hey, interesting. Deserted shelter. Where did we go last? I think we went to Wickhaven, so let's go to Tentlingen. I apologize for kind of sucking, but... Let's get you on the road again. Gain some bread, tools and supplies, medical supplies, and the morale improves. I feel like the anatomist would have just said... Yeah, we'll just take your stuff, but that's okay. I'm not really that upset. Oh, roaming beasts. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. We also have the bringers of peace, which are many mercenaries. 
Let's see how this is. What are they willing to pay? 1,330 crowns. I think we'll take this. I think we can take this. All right. Let's also take a look. We have a beggar. Terrible resolve. Terrible HP. Decent fatigue for a beggar. Not great initiative, but 57 out of 57. Really good defensive stats as well. I feel like that's kind of undercut by the minus initiative and then the fact that he has very, very low resolve. It's going to kind of... It's going to be a little rough. Uh, regardless of that, there's also Wolfhild, which is a refugee. 56 out of 57. Phenomenal melee defense. Phenomenal fatigue and initiative. Has frail, so minus 3 fatigue, minus 5%. Experience gain, blah, blah, blah. That's fine, that's fine. But man, 12 base defense. And then this, yeah, yeah. She's, so she's 5 daily wages and 50 gold to hire. Oh, did we lose? Yeah. Shoot. That's frustrating. That's frustrating. I thought we went... I, uh, I feel like we just... Let's see, hold on. Renown is at 750. Yeah, because we canceled that, I think we had to cancel the whole thing. All right, what are these guys? Direwolves, 11 of them. No bringers of peace, don't you dare. Keep these going. 11 direwolves. If we can get the bringers of peace, who uh, I'm fairly certain are around here somewhere, we should be able to get our great amount of money here. That'll also give us a good amount of renown as well. Come on. Trading caravan. A few caravan hands and a few caravan guards. Probably not worthwhile. We need... Those mercenaries. Alright, come on. Do we help them? Maybe we help them with these guys? Ah, that might actually be... That might be worth it. So let's help these guys out. Oh, dear. Oh, the, the dire wolves are reinforcing from over there? Are you kidding me? That's crazy. All right. Well, um, huh. This is going to be tricky then, huh? That's kind of insane that they were reinforcing from way over there. Okay, I see footsteps. I see footsteps. Need to keep an eye on our food. Okay, trading caravan of 11, a militia veteran, and many caravan guards. Okay, yeah, we can make this work. Alright, we can definitely make this work. Alright, where's that militia veteran? What does he look like? Is that that guy? Ooh, boy. We're getting a little, uh, we're getting a little feisty here. Oh, that's the militia veteran. Okay, I think I'm gonna shield up. Try and get you down. That didn't work. That did work. Uh, this guy doesn't have a shield, which is kind of a big deal. But he is a dodge tank. So that's significant. Now, as far as you are concerned, 54% chance. That's eh. That's fine. Um, do I want to do that? No, I don't. I think we're just going to shield up and let them do their thing for right now. And we got that guy down. Excellent. Perfect job. Nice. So he's having a bad day. This guy is t he is breaking. So he is losing a fair bit in terms of... Uh, I think it's 20% melee skill and melee defense as well. So we're in a good spot. You're in a very good spot. Although that still hurt GNL. Okay. Perfect shot. Nice job. Alright, that militia veteran might not be having a good day. Oh, come on. Leave something for me. Here, let's see what we can work with here. 65% chance, and we'd get it, and we get the organs. Give me the organs. 
All right. Try and try and uh, get that guy down. That was unfortunate. Okay, we can't do that, but we can move forward in that. Ah, perfect. So that'll help us out with Aiden. That'll, uh... I keep getting scared that these are the guys, uh, these are the enemies, but they aren't, uh, they are Argus. Which is just fine by me. Let's go ahead and rotate with you. Get the shots off, or get the hits off. Man, missing 76s? That's a little rough. But we got, we got what it counts. Or got what counts, excuse me. Ah, darn it. That was, what did we, what did we just miss? 77%? Darn. Tarnation. Although, who knows? Maybe we will be able to get finish that off? 57, double 57 miss. There we go. Perfect. Is that our guy? That was a caravan guard. Nope. Alright, fair enough. Excellent. Almost done. Come on, give me, give me the 90. Give me the 90. Holy cow. And he gets the head cut off. Darn it. I want that. I mean, I can't complain too much, but still. You know? Casey, I believe in you. You're doing great. Let's get these guys around here. It's gonna kill him, isn't it? Nope. I think we should be okay as long as we kill that. Excellent. All right, and well done. So we get four level ups here. Uh, we do have three adrenaline glands and an unusually large wolf pelt. We also still do have the potion of flesh, uh, flesh knitting, venom blood, and the potion of blade dancing. So I'm I'm curious how you know how is that all supposed to work if we're also you know, simultaneously getting really hit hard, honestly. Okay. We're low on food. There we go. Uh. Okay. Nope. I've had enough. That was worth a shot. Perfect. All right. And there is a ton of food. We can also get some dyes here. That is phenomenal. Or at least uh, the, the food is cheap, I should say. Maybe not a ton of food, but the food is cheap, and we are relatively rich right now. I will not complain. Uh, we can also get this wine. I think we do that, and then... What else do we got? Find a location, return an item, or obtain an artifact. Let's do that. 480 crowns. Obtain the seal of the false king at Stonefist Keep Ruins. I think we can absolutely make that work. Uh, everyone seems to be pretty content right now uh wolfhild i want you so bad because you're just such a good tank like that looks so so strong uh here's the real question though how are we do doing on this 715 we need to get uh, a little bit more here all right false king must die a few ancient legionary auxiliaries a few ancient legionaries. I think we're not equipped for this, but we might be able to do it. Actually, you know what? We're more prepared than I anticipated. Um, the legionaries are sketchy, though. Six in total. Let's see what we can do here. I think we can actually fight these guys. I think we can fight these guys. Oh, we can't get through? Darn it. Uh, sluggish. Minus 25% initiative from the Hollenhund. Definitely not the best thing to be hitting with, uh, those... Let's see, 67% chance. Uh... 
minus 0% total HP damage using Impale. Let's try and get these guys then. Big hits are a good thing. Shield up. Ooh, that's not good. Okay, one shield damage. Nice. Okay. Ouch! Casey, no! Did, what did I do wrong? Okay. Casey got to get out of there. I'm sorry. You missed a 30% chance. Okay, fine. Uh, I take that back. Alright, one's down. Let's get these guys. Ooh, okay. Goodness, these guys are killing me. Alright, missing the 72% chances here. That's a little rough. Tell you what. Those guys are tough cookies. Okay, but that one is doing okay. Shield up there. Ah. Alright. I think we gotta run. Okay. These guys are getting really good shots off. And we're missing 67 shots. Man, this is killing me. This is killing me. Wow, it's killing me. Oh, this is killing me. We're going to kill the whole troop here. Um, all right. Everyone's just dying. Everyone's dying. I would love to hit these shots the same way they are. I am going to lose my mind. All right. Uh, tell you what. We need to retreat. Okay, we got to get out of here. It is absolutely necessary. I'm sorry, Al Boyne, the Dodge Tank. Nope. Just get out of there. Oh my gosh. Just get out of there. Okay, GNL with the company for 21 days. Took part in 18 battles and has 14 kills. Thank you. Level 5. I am sorry. I am sincerely sorry. But we got our stuff. Alright, Tentlingen now has high spirits and I'm crying, so <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh no. Okay, how many how are we feeling? We're feeling okay. We're feeling okay, relatively speaking. Uh, that was terrible. That was absolutely terrible. Uh, on the plus side, though, we should be close to... Oh, we got four renowned for that. Awesome. Man, that's killing me. That's killing me. All right, everybody healed up a little bit. That's good. We are doing okay. We just don't have tools. Uh, high spirits, buying items for 5% more, selling items for 5% less, and 10% more items on sale. We do have one person that we need to replace, I think, probably, before I do anything crazy. Wolf Hild looks good. Uh, what was... What was GNL Returns? Uh, GNL Returns was... A melee specialist. Yeah, melee specialist. So, I mean, we should probably try and replace that if we can, if at all possible. Um, it was a really good deal, too. Historian. Interesting. Disloyal, though. Wolf Hild. Oh, wow. Wolf Hilda. 64 out of 62. Death Wish and a team player. Uh, phenomenal ranged stats, but maybe not the best there. 
I really feel like you're going to be a phenomenal pickup for how cheap you are, no less. Uh, so let's give you that. We need shields. We need more shields is what we need. Um, all right. So first off, let's go ahead and upgrade levels. So the dodge tank. Let's get you more dodge tanky stuff. And let's actually get you dodge. Uh, I suppose I thought you had dodge. You did not. So that's uh, that's not great on my part. But nonetheless, uh, let's get you some range defense. That'll be super nice. And then at level two, or at level four, excuse me, for your third tier pickup. I don't even know why I said two at all. Rotation, easy, easy pickup. All right, Kimosabe, the replaceable, is becoming less and less replaceable. Let me be honest with you. Uh, let's upgrade your initiative here, and then I feel like you're doing great with Spear Mastery, so I do really like that. We're going to do that for you. Uh, we could do Bandage Mastery for you, actually. So, two-handed D-Tank. Let's, let's anticipate that you are going to get uh, like a, a level two cleaver. I mean, that's a, that's a thought, but we're going to keep working. So, in any case, uh, find a location might not be a bad idea. Okay. Okay, find the monument of two hopelessness some way to the east and somewhere around the region of Torched Plains. It seems like a nice little deal. Some way to the east, huh? Okay, found it. And it looks like uh, some Weeder Gangers and some Geists. Interesting. Twelve of them in total. That is far more than we can in and comfortably handle. But that'll give us a little bit more uh, breathing room, so to speak. And everything is still incredibly cheap. So perhaps what we do is we just buy more, you know? So who would pay lots for dyes, right? Uh, we do need to buy some tools, but I think for right now, we are absolutely going to try and make some money off of this. Let's go, uh, yeah, let's go. Oh, okay. Nice. Okay, Tentlingen. The people of Tentlingen like us very much, which is always a positive thing. So, buying and selling materials for more, buying and selling items, uh... Or less. Not great. Not great. But actually, it's I kind of funny um, that they are buying the dyes for relatively cheap, actually. Other than that, though, I, I don't. Yeah, it's it's just not objectively worth anything to, to stay here and do that. Things are very, very expensive. Let's go ahead and sail over to. What is it? Holn Island? And then hopefully we can make a little bit of money there because that's kind of our issue right now. All right, we can sell the dyes for a fair profit. We could pick up some cloth. We could... Yeah, the wine is not being sold for very much, is it? Huh. Okay. We can sell a few of these. Just keep our, our food up a little bit. The Man, the tools are so expensive. I can't even believe it. It's crazy. Uh, how are we doing on... Alright, Wolfhild, you actually don't have a hat. Or anything. So, that's going to be priority number one. A patch toad is 25. Akaton... We, get a, we can get an Akaton, get a nasal helm. I think that's probably going to be worthwhile. Other than that, let's get this. And... Do we want... I mean, we could probably salvage a few of these, but... I don't know if that's necessarily worthwhile. Alright, that's phenomenal. So you're going to be tanky as all get out. Alright, let's just make decisions on these guys. So, for your perk, um, you are going to be... This is, I wish this was a cleaver, but it's not. So, uh, for a two-handed tank, I'm going to say you're going to run with a cleaver. 
we just don't need it right now. So instead, let's get you something that's going to help. And I think probably what we do is... Do we just get gifted? Gifted is not a bad pickup here. Uh, alternatively, uh, back to basics, I think is going to be really, really good. Plus five melee defense until the start of the next turn whenever they take damage. So let's try that. Now for Aiden the Loyal, you are currently our... Uh, our Rally the Troops guy, but doesn't have Rally the Troops. Not a big deal. Let's get you Polar Mastery if we have it. Looks like we don't. So instead... Hmm, a little rough. A little rough, but... We can make do with it. We can make do. Uh, we don't have enough for bags and belts plus quick hands. That is unfortunate, but... I get that. I get that. We could do blend in with you, actually, because you don't have phenomenal HP. You're also minus 20 initiative. Um, blend in would probably be good. So let's let's keep that. Let's keep that. All right, 252 here. And then let's try and go to... Can we go to Eisenwall? See what Eisenwall has to offer. 185 even less that's insane no one wants to buy anything all right let's go to Gronenberg it's got to be something right all right let's for right now let's try and hit the salvage tent a bit okay that'll give us six tools that'll at least give us something but I guess we're hunting for food aren't we yeah whatever no big deal. We got some people who are happy now. Uh, the dyes are not being sold for very much, which is really unfortunate. I don't understand why the... Uh, the wine is being sold for like one-tenth of everything. Is that because... I, I guess I don't know why that would be. Hmm. Well, let's sell one of these dyes and continue to try and move on out. We'll go to Wacker's Festa. Try and get some more money here. I think that's really what we're trying to do here. We have a ton of money. And no one wants to buy the wine. No one wants to buy the, the, the grain. I mean, I guess, but... What confuses me is it's like you buy it for ridiculous amounts of money. I don't know. I don't understand. I would have thought that the... Uh, it doesn't quite work that way, but apparently it does. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at what we can buy for our troops, though. If there's any two-handed stuff, uh, that would be really, really nice. Padded surcoats are always good. Uh, you are currently running with a gambeson, which is good. Wolfhild, you are very, very low. So that's a problem. Uh, we could get the padded surcoat. And that's probably a good plan. You can get the padded leather armor as well. So let's let's equip you with that. Pretty low on uh, on troops and supplies and all that, or not supplies, but uh, you know what I'm talking about. But in any case, let's keep moving. See again, no purchasing of any of the equipment or any of the uh, the food or drink. That's kind of weird. Alright, uh, horror in the woods, spiders, and taking action, deadly beasts. So what we need to do here is if we're going to fight the spiders, we do need to actually take that uh, take that spear back. And we'll go from here. Because that's going to be kind of the big thing there. Okay, Webnex nest, 650... Uh, Alright, let's go ahead and give it a shot here. You can also give the... Uh, ooh, you know what? This might be nice, because that'll give some of our troops the ability to fight back. How's your, how's your equipment? Not really working well, huh? The Webneck Nest. 650 is kind of a sketchy, sketchy ploy here. You know, honestly, let's, uh, 
Let's repair. I want to make sure that we have as much stuff as we can ready to go. Use all of our tools. That's okay. Um, the additional things that I would want, though, is... I mean, maybe we could do training grounds? I don't actually know what it does. Yeah, nope, not worth. Uh, can we craft anything? Could craft an antidote. That's not a bad idea. But in any case, for right now, let's just go ahead and forage. So once we're done foraging, we will be uh, pushing onto that nest. Right, we got some fresh fruit. Perfect. You are drawn to the muffled screams and sobbing prayers of those trapped within the shimmering webs. Alright. This is going to be bad. 16 of them in total. Uh, abducted villager, though. Kimosabe got hit up. Oh, dear. We gotta break out Kimosabe. We also gotta crush these webs, uh, these eggs. Oh, you're kidding me. All right. Alright, Abducted Villager is... Oh, interesting. I actually get to control Abducted Villager. These guys are not very good at getting themselves free. No, they are not. So we could do... What? 20% thrust? Uh... Oh, this is going to be a little rough here. How do we want to play this? I don't think that Cheros is going to be able to do this on his own, but the alternative is leaving KZ on his own, and that is probably even less palatable. So, I'm going to say, yeah, let's not do that. Oh, come on. You 80... What is today's deal? Okay, let's get that down. Okay, Alboin is webbed up. Yes, smash them. Uh, what these guys are going to be good for is supporting the troops and basically being a nuisance. Uh, now, Wolfhild, you have only 58 melee attack only. It's it's very decent, don't get me wrong, but uh, I need you to be a little bit more competent here. So we're going to wait. We're going to support uh, Cheros from this side in case there is any webbing going on. Big hits. And then you guys, I, I think we'll just leave you here. Let's break free. Good hits. All right, they're flanking. Alboin, stop it! All right, Cheros getting webbed up. That's fine. Both these guys getting webbed up. That's not fine. Uh, let's tr try and get these guys out. No dice, unfortunately, but that's okay. Smash them! Smash them good! Perfect, that one's down. Uh, we could repel... The repel is 73% chance to hit. We will do so. Go ahead and rotate out. Uh, let's wait for the abducted villager, who starts in three turns. Uh, spear wall up. Perfect. That one's down. Miss, but that's okay. I'm good with it. All right, 22 in total. That's scary. That's very scary. All right, and you are poisoned? No. Let's 
Let's wait for these guys. I really don't like how these guys are effectively killing our troops just faster than we can get to them. Shield up. There we go. Alright, we'll wait for you. Oh, man. These 69% chance misses are killing me. I'll tell you what. Let's get him out of here. Alright, Kimosabe is actually, he's not injured at all. He's just scared. Which, understandably so. Do not get me wrong. Uh, they have 22 of them in total, and it appears that there's only going to be more. Nice. Okay, worthwhile. Okay, webbed up. Got a support from this side, I think. Let's see, you are injured, not injured, injured. Missed, so it doesn't matter. Rolling a 68. Is that, is that a thing? No. Okay. Perfect. Another one down. Uh, let's just wait for you. Ah, the 69, 69, 76 misses. Oh, man. Classic. Classic, I tell you. Uh, I do wish I had rotation on this guy, but I don't, unfortunately. Off with its head. Perfect. And there is more. 21. Alright, this is where... This is where our abducted villagers come in clutch here. Okay. Let's get you out. Perfect. Well done, well done. I suppose you can't really do much, can you? Okay, I think the more important thing here is to... Keep you safe. Okay, we're gonna do that. Alright, that one's down. That's okay. I accept that. Alright, missed. We're just gonna keep, keep you safe here. So, it's almost a guaranteed hit. Or almost guaranteed get out on that one. Awesome. Another one goes down. Alright, that one finally took a hit, which is excellent. Perfect. That's all we needed. Oh, there's so many of them. And we miss another 69. The number of 69 rolls that we've missed is absolutely obscene. Alright, and it looks like Alboin is going to be uh, killed, unfortunately. I'm very sorry to say. Let's go ahead and wait for you. Another... Oh, these high percentage chance misses are absolutely slaying me. Uh, we can't rotate with you. That's right. I'm... Alboin is going to die if I don't rotate him. I think that's the problem. Wait. Oh, you just have a bandage. Okay. Fair enough. Yeah, you're going to die anyway, actually. Alright. For the... I'm sorry, what? These guys are running with... I'm sorry, what? Wait, these guys have 77% chances to hit? Holy cow, these web-necked hatchlings are amazing. I had no idea. How... Seventy-seven percent chance to hit. 
Insane. Well, uh... All it takes is one battle. But this is... Yeah, this is gonna be the end. For 650 gold, I don't really think that was worth it. To fight 22... Oh, man. Yeah, we're done. We're absolutely done. We're toasted. I mean, th these guys, these webnecked hatchlings are kind of obscene. Like, they're running with 79 or 77 percent chances to hit against uh, a dodge tank. That's ah, crazy. I mean, I guess I don't I don't really know what I should have done there. In that case, it's tricky to know what to do, but they they sure they sure do take a lot of damage. But man, with fast adaptation, 68 percent chance to hit. Yeah. They're hitting every shot. I mean, it doesn't really matter at this point. So we'll play it through, but um, yep, this is this campaign is over, unfortunately. That that was a a mistake on my end. I, I didn't realize that it was so crazy. These guys are just insanely powerful. I do remember reading something about the uh the webnecks being toned down. Apparently this was not the case, or at least it wasn't from my experience, but... I don't know. I thought for a one skull mission to have 20... Well, I mean, it's close to 30 webnecks at this point. Uh, that, that may be just a little too much for me. It's sad, too, because, it, I mean, it wasn't like a huge amount of money, but uh, it is what it is. I mean, do what you can. So we're done. Routed to a man. I'm wondering if... Uh, if somehow the scaling with this game is just so vastly different that I'm just not familiar with it. Because it does... It does kind of feel a little bit unfair, almost. Like, this should be a three-skull mission at this point. Maybe not. Maybe not. But to start with... 20, what, what was it? Uh, so we started with 12 eggs. And then within three turns, we had 22 more, even though we killed, I want to say, five of them at the beginning. And these guys are also doing 60, 70% chances to hit. Yeah, it's it's too much. It's too much for us. We do we do our best, but it's uh, it is not enough. Even Cheros with, uh, Cheros is running, well, I mean, at this point, but just running with some amazing stuff was, uh, was not able to come out, out top with it. Now, it does look like, uh, for example, these would have provided some um, absolutely amazing loot, but unfortunately, that's going to be all for us today. Um, yep, stash, the stash size has changed. The cruel finality you have doled out upon others has returned in totality, claiming the lives of the entirety of the dead runners. Few will speak of you, and certainly no more than crows who squawk out claims to your corpses. With no shortage of work for hired swords in this world, there's always the next mercenary band to take your place. Oh man, that was rough. That was absolutely rough. Well, I'll tell you what, thank you guys for watching. We'll be starting another campaign here. I feel like I'm just starting campaigns left and right, but realistically, this is me learning how to play Legends. So... I mean, I, I took a bad contract, and I was like, okay, yeah, what can it be? It's, it's, I mean, it's Webnex, it's one skull, it's 650 crowns. Okay, we could do this. No. No, we cannot. I think even if, if we had, uh, maybe if we had, like, 14 people, and each one of them had, you know, decent things. But the other thing is, man, the amount of 60, 70% rolls that we were absolutely getting screwed on was just, it's a little rough, but... In any case, that's all for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the, the campaign with the Dead Runners, and uh, we'll figure out something. We'll figure out something new to play. Uh, I don't know if it's going to be maybe the Beast Slayers or maybe another Anatomist campaign. I'm not. I'm not sold one way or another. But 
in any case, thank you guys so much, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.